Welcome back to Simply Logical. This is Venkatesh. Let's see if you can solve this one. Watch the diagram very carefully. Use the clues available in the diagram and now answer what is the height of the table in centimeters. Pause the video and give it a try before checking the solution and do not forget to comment the answer in the comment section. If you are new to the channel do subscribe to the channel and enable notifications so that you do not miss any of our videos. Let's check the solution now. Whenever you come across such kind of problems without hesitation try to solve it systematically instead of following some blind methods. The most logical way of solving this problem is by creating the equations. If you observe the diagram there are three important components. They are table, cat and tortoise. Let's assume that height of the table is t, height of cat is c and height of tortoise is r. Let's write down the equations by observing the diagram. As per the first diagram, total height of the table along with cat excluding the tortoise height can be written as t plus c minus r equals 170 centimeters. So here t is the height of the table and c is the height of the cat and r is the height of the tortoise. Since the height of the tortoise is not included in the diagram, we are excluding it by subtracting r which is resulting in 170 centimeters. As per the second diagram, total height of the table along with the tortoise excluding the cat height can be written as t plus r minus c is equal to 130 centimeters. If you observe it carefully, so the height includes the table and the tortoise excluding the height of the cat. Hence the equation becomes like this. Now we have formed two equations. When there are two equations, then the job becomes simple. Let's solve these equations by adding both the equations, which results in t plus t, which is 2t plus c minus r plus r minus c equals to 170 plus 130 centimeters. In the equation, we can cancel plus r minus r plus c minus c. Finally, it results in 2t is equal to 300 centimeters and finally t is equal to 150 centimeters. This is the solution for the problem. The height of the table is 150 centimeters. By following these simple steps, we can solve the problem in minimum time. Most of the time what happens is the people try to solve some blind method without even using the equations. See, sometimes it may work, but most of the times you fail to answer with a given time. So I always recommend to all my students and the candidates to go with a systematic approach instead of following some blind approach. So that's all for this video. Let me know if you have any questions. I will try to answer as soon as possible. Let's meet in the next video. Thank you.